Echeveria taurus, agroplants.org, also known as Echeveria agavo- agavoidis taurus. So this perennial evergreen, it's used for ornamental for the color leaves, as you can see. Uh, it's, uh, as I said, ornamental, and it's draw tolerant also. You can grow it in a variety of climate, desert, subtropical, Mediterranean, temperate, or tropical climate. Hardiness zone will be from 9+. plus. Uh, also, you can grow it as a house plant. If you would like to purchase, there is a link below, link in the right top side. And if you purchase, this is donation. Also, don't forget to subscribe. Uh, this is really help to this channel to grow. So, the Taurus uh, color leaf will be green, purple, red, pink, orange, and mostly more than one color. Uh, flowers can be, li- be uh, purple, blue, yellow. And except this, uh, it can it's grow with frost, but better to grow it above five t- uh, five degrees Celsius. Uh, except this drainage of the soil, it's uh, very important. And uh, except except the drainage that you need to take care, of, there isn't a special requirement uh, uh, to in order to the soil. The soil is simple. Uh, by the way, five degrees Celsius, it's 40, 40 something. Uh, let's say 41, 42 uh, Fahrenheit, something like this, sorry, uh, probably I miscalculate. You can start to grow it by seeds, but really no point, it's just harder. Uh, better to start by cuttings, can be leaf or stem. If you start by leaf, I think it's super easy, just take, with your hand, just take the leaf itself and wait a few days. After you wait in the shade better, uh, check that the tissue heal. The moment that it's healed, you can put it on the soil, treat it the same as you treat fully grown plant. If you start by stem, be aware that it's exactly the same. Take a little bit more time to heal, and you need to have support sometimes that it won't fall. Depend what kind of stem you take, but support will be important. If it's moved too much, it might won't uh, root well. It will root, but a lot of time it uh, will be cut the roots. Except this, you can uh, start by uh, indoor, so then it's make you can make it all the year. But if not, spring to summer, uh, it's a uh, it's a good uh, good time to start. Uh, be aware that the leaves are a little bit pointed. Uh, watch out if you don't know decided to put it uh, on your skin for some reason. No point. Uh, planting season will be from the spring to the summer in the hardiness zone of 9 to 10a spring to the autumn in hardiness zone of 10a to 11a all the year from hardiness zone of 11b plus or even 11a you can all the year it's also possible major pests are snail and slugs not something crucial Uh, pruning it's just dead leaves uh, if you want, you can even let them die, just take them in the end by your hand. It gives all the mineral back to the plant, so it's a little bit better. Less beauty, but better for the plant. The height of the plant is uh, 10 to 30 cm, uh, 4 to 12 inch. Usually the leaves are 10 to 15 cm, so it's 4 to 6 inches. And the bloom stem is between, uh, let's say, 10 to 30 cm, so it's been 8 to 12 inch uh, size of the leaves uh, doesn't really matter uh, so it's slow growing plant is the right condition it requires small amount of water a uh, prefer small amount but can uh, with good drainage grow also well in bigger amount of water the light condition will be in full sun in, in hot summer the leaf will burn so reduce it a little bit uh, in winter of hardiness zone of 9b to 10b uh, let's say 10a uh, better to uh, to put it in full sun half shade uh, in hot climate will be better because it's uh, burns the leaves but uh, if you don't have like a 46 or 47 celsius degree uh, that it's been in fahrenheit just a second i will calculate uh, 110 120 fahrenheit something like this so uh, you can grow it actually in full sun. 
half shade, a uh, full shade with light, of course. You can grow it as a house plant in indoor, it's not a problem. Uh, also in a container, it's not very hard. Use a sandy soil, better to put in the bottom of the, uh, the pot. Uh, gravels, little rocks like gravel, lava rocks, pebbles, pebbles, something like this. And this is will take care of the drainage. Uh, blooming season, it's in the summer. And except this, it's really easy to grow without special requirement. It's mostly you leave and forget, just put water once in a while. That it's, that's all. That's all from growplants.org. Don't forget to subscribe, visit our website. And of course, if you have any question, just ask. You have here links about more videos, some list, subscribe. And of course, purchase a plant and this is donation for our channel. I hope you enjoy and come visit us again.